Good morning guys, Dave and Rona down here in beautiful Howe Sound. We went e-foiling this morning, so it's early April. Uh, so we still got fresh snow on the mountains. The water's pretty cold, but as you can see, there's no one out there except some whales and seals, so super cool. And I wanted to do a video on the stuff that I use that allows me to get out e-foiling this early in the season and also late in the season. So one of the things I use for safety to keep my phone in is this Fidlock waterproof case. It's a, a magnetic closure. I've used this for years. I can take photos and videos, use my phone. So if I have an emergency, I can use my Zolio on my phone if I'm not in cell coverage or just my phone to contact rescue, which is really, really important. But that's one of the essential pieces. It tucks away in my pocket in my dry suit so it's easy to access as well. The other thing that I got that I've tried, I tried neoprene gloves, but once they get wet, they get very cold and it's the wind that really makes you cold. So I actually have been using these seal skin gloves, which are amazing. I use these all winter long mountain biking, the socks version. So I got these for heat boiling thanks to my friend, thanks to my friend Theo Epp, and they are a game changer. They're Gore-Tex, windproof and waterproof. So your hands don't even really get wet. And if they do, there's no wind hitting it. So they stay nice and warm. And then lastly, the most important thing is this Kokatat dry suit. Now I have used the Ocean Rodeo, as you know, in the past, and I love that dry suit, but it was time to upgrade it. And this time I went with the feet. I was really nervous about getting feet at the beginning because I thought, oh, that's gonna, they're gonna wear out and the dry suit won't last because of that. And it is true, you don't wanna be walking around the beach or docks without any protection over these booties. But as you can see, I just have a pair of Nike free running shoes and they slip over top of the dry suit and now they're well protected and it is a game changer. Your feet are totally dry, uh, obviously with a dry suit, but they're warm. Even when you're in the water, you don't even really feel just the coolness of the water and it is a must have for every dry suit, I believe. This is the Coke Tau, uh kayak dry suit, so it works with a spray skirt. You don't need to get that if you're just defoiling or using it for kite surfing or wing foiling, but what a game changer. This one is so light, uh, you don't even realize that it's on most of the time. And when you, I went swimming this morning and it's like at first you think you're gonna be cold and you just feel the coolness of the water, but you're totally 100% dry. So it really extends your e-foil session by uh, in the year by a month and a half at the start and by a month and a half at the end of the season so a huge advantage having a dry suit if you own an e-foil and you want to get out and you live in the colder climates like i do in squamish bc you need one so those are the things that i use and again you can check it out online or at any cool store one of the great stores here in british columbia is western canoe and kayak talk to ryan baines he'll set you up with the right dry suit that you need when you're out on the water and you can check them out online at Western Canoe and Kayak. We'll see you out on the water.